Hello viewers, you are watching Miss Continental YouTube channel. Welcome to my returning subscribers. Uh, so guys, I know a uh, few hours ago I released a video and I'm doing this again. Uh, typically, I don't uh, produce videos back and forth. I try to stay with just a video per week. But I have to do this because, you know, I came across some few videos and things are happening, right? And I really find those things very disturbing and I just need to come and, you know, drop one or two things here. So, uh, guys, if we are not ready and I'm talking to youths now, come on. If you are not ready to do something, don't even start it. Because when you start it, you don't complete it. You not look like the boy who cry wolf. Believe me and you, um, this uh, protest that's going on, I mean uh, protest against NSAS, NSWAT and all that. We are, uh, all this, the slogan that we are crying out there in the, in the street is end this, end this, end SAS, end SWAT, end SAS, end SWAT. So we kind of make it look like, you know, the problem is just SAS or SWAT when we know there are underlying issues, you know, that also need to be addressed. Although I know uh, uh, we've had the opportunity to, you know, send some representative to speak with the a Nigeria uh, AIG uh, police and, you know, some issues have been tabled down. But I think it's high time we change our slogan. Um, again, apart from that, it seems that some youth now are becoming very over ambitious, you know, with what is going on. You know, there's this saying, they say Nigeria not the carry last. But this is not something we need to politic uh, We need to turn into politics or we need to uh, turn into money venture, uh, this thing, because any opportunity we have, I mean, I trust my people. Like, any opportunity. This is not kidding. This is not a joke. We started a good course. At the time of producing my period, my most recent video, I was very optimistic. Seeing the mobilization, the united front, you know, the chanting and everything. People abandoning their homes, their families to come and street in the streets, to go and sleep in the streets of Nigeria to protest something. You know, I was really very, you know, encouraged and me like, you know, we are heading somewhere. Ah, so but what is happening now? Like, anyways... It's been infiltrated right now. Things are going on that I may not be able to disclose here right now. But I just want to play a quick video for you right now. Just one of them. Um, one of those youths that I am thinking is is not even aware of what is going on. Could be, permit me to say, no insults to Davido or his fans. But because I'm saying this because Davido had the opportunity to go and sit with um, the... Uh, the speaker of you know our national assembly and it, it was like they were having a dinner they were having a dinner laughing over what like what are they talking what, what are they laughing about i didn't find that funny at all i didn't find that funny and you know one thing again all these are our leaders come on we are not go change they will not change these people that you see they will not change they think they are smart and i am so pissed off i am so angry i'm so disturbed my spirit is so vest i know it's not about me but this is how i'm taking it okay David of all people who know nothing about politics, who is not even an activist, is he the right person to be invited to come and talk about things that affect youth? Like, what happened to Shuere? Is Shuere not a youth? Are there no other people, intellectualists, like, I'm not saying David is a Dondu or, or Lodo, but he's not the right person. If you are talking about composing a music to kind of, you know, Ah, uh, to kind of <laughs> summarize what is going on so that, you know, history will have it and they will sing to the tune of this current event. That one a different thing. But to discuss about, to, uh, to, 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 to speak for the youths in a nation, like, what did they don't know? Now, this, this is the same problem. You know what? I say our kabas they will never change. This is the same instance of putting a minister... I mean, a police, uh, uh, head of police, you go and take somebody that read agriculture in the university, you go put them for police. Somebody that read medicine, you will go be a uh, uh, speaker 
of house of assembly somebody that read uh, 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 literature he will go be doctor for office this is the same thing they are now doing with youth you go carry the video and be an artist you see me you come house of assembly we are lawmakers day hey my people we well, not understand this thing that I'm saying now. At the face, but my body they hot. Why not carry lawmaker like Una put for them on account they discuss what is going on? Don't we have youths? Don't we have people that are in the society that can come out and represent the youth on, a, on an intellectual ground? Like really speak for you. Why Davido? Why Davido? Because they want to pray on that little boy because they know say he no get that he's not vast. It's not vast. They can't account there. And they ask that one, say, that, 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 that one is saying, it's not just a, it's accountability. Accountability for what? Now, today we hear about accountability, David. Oh. What is accountability? Now, accountability will want chop. Oh, you don't know that you can be seeing figures like this. You cannot, you know, go fit some of those figures. You will not know what those figures stand for. You want them to come and be giving. We don't want that. We want security electricity we want the, the uh, fuel, ga gas all those things we want food in the corner we want everybody to be okay we want a clean city a clean place it's okay about accountability is it the right person you think if it is showery that is at that meeting they go they laugh why are these leaders deceiving us why why they not go they not go change they no go change. Okay, they call David. O, if we really want to be honest with ourselves, David don't fit and say, guys, sir, I am not a professional in this bed. I will talk with my youth and we'll find the right people to go and represent us there. David don't still carry himself, go there again. Well, you know, you can't do something. You are not trained for this. Why did you go there? This is about everybody in the country. This is about the youth. This is not funny at all. Okay. For those of us who have not seen the video, please, I'm just going to play the video a little bit. You can not see the ridicule, the nonsense when they go to do for, for, for the meeting. What did they go discuss for them? How, that's, how, is that going to help us? Are they supposed to be laughing? If that's so, where are they? Would they be laughing? Let me play the video, by, guys. May not be like, say, I'm just talking here. Then I will be back quickly, Jerry. David, a delicate aka Debo and members of the Western crew, I have the singular honor and privilege to humbly welcome you to the National Assembly. Without taking much time, may I humbly call on Debo to kindly address the Honorable Speaker. You welcome Debo. Okay. <laughs> Thank you everybody. Thank you guys, thank you Mr. Speaker for accommodating us and inviting us to speak. I'm really, <clears throat> I'm really like a, how do I say this? The voice, well not the voice of people, I'm just here to really explain the pains of the people. Because I'm there in the forefront, you know, so I'm there like, um, and it's been, it's, it's been our duty for us to entertain the entertainment industry voice out. You know, just like the other countries, when there's any problem with maybe the government, it's always entertainers and you know because after after the government in Nigeria and entertainment was, Nigeria entertainment is huge. So they look to us to be able to project their views and their voices. Um this past week there were lots of protests both in Lagos so on me landing <coughs> there was another demonstration protest protesters. They had gone, I think they were facing the force headquarters. They had gone twice, before I landed, they had gone twice. And they were shot at, um, uh, tear gas, everything. So, you know, when I got to the protest, they were even abusing me. Go, they 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 beg, I go, down for them. Beg, because this, if you don't slow it down, like, if we, do, we, 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 we don't know where it's going to go. For Chris Brown to call me, I said, yo, what's going on in your country? I'm like, so after that, we must face him for set quarters and I, I urge them and I urge them to calm the way. I've never seen Nigerians so angry. And we calm down, we all sat on the floor. We saw the police before we even go there. The police. Uh, we have one or two men. Um, I Yeah, because we've got a, 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 a
That's what they are doing. Some of these individuals and artists make oh God. If not even fast now. For Larry Nabi, for Larry uh, Fanny that uh, Femi Falana's uh, uh, son. For, uh, I'm talking about fast the bad guy. If not that one they even call, they go still go because he read law. He go feel use their language with them. So where is there? Why? Why? Oh God. This is our leaders. The truth is so, it's so, it's so, it's so, it's so uh, which grandma I need somebody to help me with a grandma? May I take express myself here? Eh? So demoralizing, so frustrating to see this leader behaving like this and they are laughing. They are not taking us seriously. And now I hear say they go carry army. Now army they take the resolve protest where people they Sabisa forest animals in Sabisa forest when they need army for you know, army no figure fighter now citizens for street. Because as I say, police, no, excuse me, guys, police cannot do this anymore. I even the police in their own self, they are even happy, one way or the other, but they don't feel conscious for streets, say that they're happy. They don't feel conscious, say that they're happy. Now go to carry on me. People are agitating for something instead of you to address those issues. Now they carry on me. May all these leaders, now what go be tied on, eh? The death when you kill a bata, that one as small. The one now go there so mysterious, eh? This kind of punishment you are putting us through. Look at your citizens outside the nation, outside Nigeria. See how they are suffering abroad. You don't want them to come home. And even the ones at home, you're not taking care of them. Bastards! <laughs> 